detention. Good old detention. Let's see if they do corn here or castle. Okay, it's just corn. It's the boring version. I like the castle where you're opening more just because it's more exciting to play against. But it's not like this is like abnormal or anything. This is a very common opener. Mm. Kind of annoying that they can take this maybe. But they're probably not going to because I'll just snowball them. So this should keep the panic points safe, I think. I can kill this if they do that. They must be putting something down here, maybe. Oh, I guess not. This is like the first thing you learn on this map, though. That you can't put a phobia down here like that. Because I will just break this block. I mean, they can. It's not even going to trade, though. So, that's a bit weird for them. This is like a very common play on this map. At least early on, when players haven't figured things out. You just kill the... Raid some off like that. I think I'll just bank. There's no reason to really spend the last key. Can either get a large turret or I can get an inoculus or maybe guns or something. They do get panic point advantage here, but they lost the key for it, so I don't really mind that. It's actually probably fine for me. I could go very aggressive here, but I don't know if that's a good idea. I can also just bring an inoculus in or something. Where do I want the trap? Maybe just in front here? Don't know where they're most likely to go. Mm. Do I want a Noculus? I probably do. Just to push them back a little bit. This forces the corn to move away. But it's kind of awkward because I can always target this corn with how this looks. If I want to. I can't kill it if he sits there. That's probably the best position for it. That also allows them to put down a trap. So that's what they're likely going to do here. This is kind of aggressive from them, but it's fine. At least I think it's fine, probably. <laughs> they probably put a trap here, right? I would guess that they did. If I had to guess. Mm, do I even want that there? I can also just hit, put a one key out here. Just hit it like this. Get a one key. Probably a boomer, right? At best, I would say so. And then we can move the grave digger over here. It's a bit scary that they have a inoculus down there, though. Maybe I put it here. That way I can block them out if they want to hit my heart. Yeah, that's probably better. They will kill the couple very, very easily. And they can probably even take all of the points back if they want to be extremely aggressive. I don't know if they want to do that, though. That would be very, very aggressive. They can also just do that, I guess, though. Or are they pulling their corn out? They may just be moving the corner away or something. Yeah, they, they aren't going super aggressive. I was thinking they would move the corner up here, hit me, and then take the point with this. Although maybe they do that here. They will lose the corner if they do that, though. That is like the extremely aggressive play here. Okay, they didn't. They didn't just let the corn die. That's fair enough. They used their grave digger already, so I can go down here and take this point now with my ability. And I probably want to keep my Inoculus safe, right? Or I can just shoot here. Put a one key here in front. It should be safe, right? If I just don't take a dimensional. I just use Henrietta because I won't need it this match. So they can only... Yeah, they shouldn't be able to do anything. What do I want more than this, though? I kind of want a large phobia or something. It's a bit weird. I guess I'll just bring a stabby of my own. 
just to have another turret and then we can bank for something large after. Maybe I should have gone shovel. That may have been better. They are kind of damaged here, so this is good for me, I think. They may actually go for a healer, even. I think shovel was probably better now that I look at it. Should have thought about it a little bit more. Now I think I need a one key. Shovel may have been better because I could threaten to kill this or maybe even this. Actually, no, I can't kill that. It's a level above. But could have at least threatened something. Do I just want the stabby down there in the hole, maybe? Let's go all the way down here with it. Why not? Bring a one key. Oh, they may be trying to put the one key down here. Because I can't recap that easily with that. Then I'm forced to take damage on the stabby. I feel like that's kind of weird though. That's what they are trying to do. They're not using the bachelor to take a point. That's kind of weird. Also, can't I hit the gravedigger for free in this position? No, I can't. I was about to say, that seems weird if they would allow me to do that. Should I sacrifice mine? I don't think I should, probably. I may have to move this behind, though, just so that I can have the bachelor sit in a position where it can reach both sides here. It seems reasonable to do. Should just let them hit the block. So they, they have to use an attack on it. That way they can't go aggressive or anything. Not that I think they would do that, but... What? Oh, right, I can't kill the Anopolis because it's one health or one level above. That's why they're doing this. I was about to say, that seemed like a really odd play. Otherwise... I can just do this though, and then move away. So it's not like this matters all that much. Or anything. Also I can do this I think if I want to. Just to be a little bit aggressive. Wonder what they want to bring out here. They may try to lock me at five phobies. They may also just <laughs> try and kill my stabby. Was that what they were trying to do here? Guess not. They could have killed both the bachelor and the stabby, but I still don't think that's really worth it. Also, I think if they were planning to go boss, they shouldn't have killed my bachelor. They should just back off and make me sit at five phobies and be annoying. Can't kill this, right? No, I can't. I don't think there's any way. I could just block here and then move back. Or move up here and hit him. Like this. They can't heal it, right? So this seems fine. Yeah, I think that's fine. And then what do I want to bring against the boss? Could just freeze it actually. <laughs> just go Yeti and freeze his boss. That would be kind of funny. Because they can't counter it really. Could also just go any large phobie, but I think I like this idea. Just because that means if the boss goes up here to fireball this, then I can walk in and freeze the boss and I can just kill it very easily, I think. So this should be fine. I, of course, can't really freeze anything else because the boss would just unfreeze them. But that's not really a big deal. They may break the block and try and invade here to kill my 
Inoculus and other things. But the Gravedigger is kind of in the way whenever they do that, so it's not a big deal. They can also just kill my Inoculus quite easily. Oh, he didn't place himself on fire. He should probably put the boss on fire so that I can't freeze it. But I guess I'll kill it either way, so it's not really sensible. Wow, they're really not moving this away either. That's... I feel like you should move this away so I'm forced to move over and kill it. Also, I can just kill the boss if I want to here. But I don't know if I do. I think I'd rather... Mm, would I rather do some other things? I could... I kind of need to kill this Inoculus, I feel like. And if I do that, I don't think it's a good idea to kill this. But I still could do it, though. I mean, if I kill the boss, they kind of just don't have a way to win, right? Actually, I can't kill the boss and the Inoculus. I guess I'll just freeze this thing. And then hit it. Why not? Seems fine to do this. Gonna move this out of the way, hit with this. And probably heal this thing, just because the Yeti is my win condition, probably. At least it seems that way right now. And I'll move forward, if it will let me, it will. This does take damage from that, and it, like, looks bad, but it can just heal up again by hitting the boss. So it's not a big deal. Maybe I should have, could I have just moved it in and hit it? I think I may have missed an attack on the boss. It's not a big deal, though. They can't really do much here. I don't think. A lot of their things are going to die now. I'll probably pull my... Shouldn't I pull this in? Or will it die if I do that? Does it just die? Okay, yeah, it does. So I can't do that. Guess I'm forced to hit once with this and then take the damage on my unicorn. And then the question is... Yeah, I should, I should just kill this unicorn of his also. Then if they walk over here and kill this... Later... I mean, I should just win. I can just wait for the freeze on his stabby and kill the Grave Digger. I think this is fine. There may have been a better way of doing all this, but I just took the kind of safe route, safe route I think. Like, there can't be that many thing that, things that happen here. If they do this, I just kill this thing. Right? Now if he goes over here and hits, I move away. Wait, is that a win? No, because I have two turns on that. Maybe I take the damage on the Yeti? No, because this dies either way, so I shouldn't do that. Maybe I just move away. Not sure what is correct here. Also, if they take the point, they do just die. If they don't take the point, I have to like move down here, maybe? And then wait for the freeze. Hopefully. Or I just have to move one back, actually. Oh, they're doing this to stay away from the... What's it called? From the traps. But I don't think they can win. <laughs> no matter what they do, they just get frozen here, right? Yeah, they do. Pretty close, though. <laughs> I could likely have made this less close. That's kind of unlucky for them. It lives with like 50 health, yeah. But it's not even like they were underleveled or anything, so they can't be mad about this. Like, that's just how it ended up being here. Their level is actually slightly higher than mine. Pretty fun match, though. There may have been better things to do than Yeti against boss and stuff. But it's always fun to see, like... Freeze against fire match, or whatever you want to call that. A 
I feel like I should have been able to kill the boss, but I think it was just barely some damage off because it was a high level boss, it's level 20. Otherwise I could have killed both the boss and the Anoculus and then saved the freeze and it would have been a lot easier. But it didn't work out that way. Ended up good anyway though. Barely.